this morning we're heading over to Rare Earth Goods in Ishpeming. We're joining Ansley Watson to see what they have going on out there. Good morning, Ansley. Good morning, Vicki. Well, if you like local food, art, or entertainment, Rare Earth Goods is the place for you. It's definitely a one-stop shop for all these fun little goodies such as, look at these, tie-dyed pants here. So in a bit, we'll get to talk about the local food that they have here, the merchandise, and even their open mic night. Reporting live in Ishpeming, Ansley Watson, TV6 News. All right, thank you very much, Ansley. We'll catch up with you a little bit later on. Right, For those of places to sell local items like Rare Earth Goods does, Ansley Watson is there to tell us more about some of the unique items they have to uh, make it interesting for the community. Good morning, Ansley. Good morning, Vicki. Oh my goodness, they have so much here. In fact, we need to get started right away. So I'm joined with the owner, Pam Perkins. Good morning. Good morning. So we're over here in the essential oils type area. Yep. You can make your own anything. Talk to us about this. Um, well, we do a lot of classes on how to make uh, body butters, um, lip balms, that type of stuff. Um, the essential oils are huge here. Mm -hmm. We have everything that you need to make soaps, body butters, lip balms. Yeah, I know that's a huge hit, making your own. So, and then above us, we have these aromatherapy necklaces. I know next Sunday you have a class of how you can actually make these. Talk to us about this. Well, you choose your main piece uh, and you customize your chain or your add beads. Mm -hmm. um, you can use bottles. Um, you can add scents to them. What's inside of them? Uh, some have just felt balls, okay. some like the glass cork ones, those the oil will soak up in the cork and you'll smell it through the cork. Some have clay beads. Mm. Wow. Well, let's take a little hike over to the other side of the store here. Okay. And so we've got, you have so much. There's ground coffee here, food. Here's the coffee right here and people can grind them, grind it themselves, correct? Yes. Um, local coffees roasted locally. We have got Dead River Coffee and Up North Roasters. Okay. Um, and an old A&P coffee grinder, which really makes it wonderful. You crank that by hand then? No, it's, it's electric. Okay. Uh, we got tea in bulk, uh, spices in bulk. Fresh ground almond butter. Okay, this is really neat. Talk to me about this machine. You said it's super uh, old. This is a this old style peanut grinder is about a hundred years old. Wow. It makes the best almond butter. Look at that. It comes out warm. Really? It's oh wow. Yummy. It's so interesting to see. I did not know that almonds could make this type of consistency. And it's just almonds there's nothing added right. no added sugar no added oil incredible are these, stuff are these dry roasted almonds or are they raw uh i you know i believe they're raw okay yeah that looks so delicious I, we tasted some earlier and it's so yummy <laughs> so moving on here we've got some spices and oils oils in bulk we got a great clothing line here we um have local eggs uh Ginnon farms grass-fed beef local beers and wines, great selection. You can mix your own um, local greeting cards by Liz Yelland, 163 artists who display and sell their work That's here. That's a lot, a lot of So we help, we help the local artist community Absolutely. too. I want to look at some of these clothes. These are really, really fun. I and mean, where do you, you order these, right? Yes. Do you, do you come back and try these on in time? I, I think I would. I, <laughs> I think I have like one of every one of these hoodies. <laughs> And so them. much tie dye, how fun. Well, in a little bit, we're going to talk about there's a little cafe in the back, and you guys actually do an open mic night. Yeah, on Tuesday nights. It's private by invite only. If you'd like to join us, um, call and talk to me. Um, yeah. Be glad to invite you. We'll talk more about that in the next se segment. Stay with us. Reporting live in Ishpeming, Ansley Watson, TV6 oh. News. All right, thank you very much, Ansley. As we get ready for the day, we just received... Welcome back. Well, this morning we're at Rare Earth Goods talking about all the things that they have to offer. Ansley Watson joins us now to tell us a little bit more about it. Good morning, Ansley. Good morning, Sam. Oh my goodness, you can come here and have a little jam sesh every Tuesday <laughs> night. We'll talk about that here in a second. I'm joined with the owner, Pam Perkins. Good morning. Good morning. So we are surrounded by a, a little 
area where you can come and play some instruments. Talk to me about open mic night. That sounds so much fun. Well, it's private by invite only, um, though I pretty much invite anyone. If you'd, <laughs> if you'd like to come, just give me a call. Um, we'll fit you in. It's more or less just an open jam. Everybody kind of joins in together. We don't tell anybody they can't play or they can't sing because I think music is inspiring mm -hmm. to everyone so you're playing our, your ukulele for us earlier and yes, it's gorgeous yes. it's so oh, much fun thank can you. kids come as well oh yes kids are welcome till 8 30 and then they can there's little toys here they can play with yeah, little instruments there's instruments they can play with yep how fun so that's every tuesday night yep it starts at seven the front of the store will be locked you'll use the side or the back door okay after seven and here you also have a cafe Talk yes. to me about this. You kind of did some additional hours to this just recently. Yes. Um, the end of November, we started opening on the weekends. We're serving breakfast now. So we're doing breakfast or lunch seven days a week from 10 until 2. Um, great food in the cafe. Mm. Homemade soups, homemade oh, yeah. desserts. Um, using great ingredients. Yeah, a lot of it is local. Yes. Where do you get some of those from? Well, like I use Newski's bacon and sausage, mm. um, Dead River coffee and up north Roasters coffee, Cloverland farm fresh eggs in my quiches and breakfast items. So yeah, it's really good food. And then I know on, so you're open um, Monday through Saturday, correct? I'm open seven days a week. Seven days a week. And then yeah. classes are on Sunday. Sunday Talk from to me a little bit about these six. classes. Um, let's see. We've got a uh, aromatherapy necklace making class coming up this Sunday. Mm -hmm. um, and then the following week is the body butter making. Um, and that's really enriching for your skin this time of year yeah. when everything's dry and... and you need some moisture. Yeah. And then you also had a sewing class. How did that go over? Oh, it was good. Um, uh, some people didn't know how to use their yeah. machines at all. I taught them how to thread the machine, adjust the tension. We made zippered bags. Oh, it was fun. Great. Fantastic skills to just know. Yeah. Everybody needs to know them. Absolutely. And they also have local food, local merchandise. We were up in the upper part of the store earlier. You got you have so much here. I do. It's a it's a, a eclectic mix of <laughs> fun. Well, here at Rare Earth Goods, it's always a good time. Reporting live in Ishpeming, Ansley Watson, and we'll be back with more of your TV6 morning news after the break.